Good afternoon, Leilani and John. This is Luke from Pacific Toyota Cairns. I'm just sending you through the video presentation on our lovely 2019 RAV4 GXL Hybrid for the driveway price of $43,990. Just a quick tour of our dealership here. So you can see we do stock all different makes and models. There's the other RAV4 just here that I sent the video presentation on. All different makes and models. Upstairs there you can see our two-story showroom. So we are primarily a Toyota and Lexus dealership, but we do stock all different makes and models in our pre-owned vehicle departments if it does pass our reconditioning process. Now this is our main strip here in Kansas. This is Mulgrave Road. So about a kilometre down here, kilometre down Mulgrave Road, um, we do have another pre-owned vehicle department. We also do have down the road there our new car, Toyota and Lexus showrooms. Now we do also own Hino trucks and opposite lock four wheel driving accessories. So we are a large franchise dealer. But most importantly, let's get back to the RAV4 hybrid that you've inquired on. Now I've got the car running. Now the light, I think in the video, it might look like the LED lights are flickering just over here. Now that's, that's normal, they're definitely not flickering. Um, the LED lights are working perfectly fine in real life or in person here. Um, it's just always the LED lights, they always play play funny games with the cameras. But let's start at the front of the RAV. So being your hybrid, you do have the blue badge. LED daytime driving lights, like I said, just here. You do have your fog lights down the front. Front park assist sensors in the front bumper as well. Giants, it is a little bit dusty and dirty. They do go on test drives and it has been a bit rainy here in Cairns lately. So the rain, it rains and then the dust, you know, settles on them and stuff like that. But it will get fully detailed before it gets trucked down to Claremont for you. Now I'll try to find any imperfections on here. I'm sure there'll be a couple little stone chips I can point out. Little stone chip just here, which you can see there. I can get that brush touch for you. That's really minimal. There is another stone chip just here I wanted to point out. So that one there, I'd just take it to the paint shop and that brush touch that for us. So it won't be as noticeable. You can see there, it's just one stone chip just right there. There is a little stone chip just down here which has been brush touched, I believe, but I can get that done again to make it look a little bit better. Another little stone chip just here. There's a couple of tiny little stone chips just on the front. Oh, that's a bit of dirt, sorry. I thought that was a stone chip, but just a little bit of dust or dirt stuck to the front. So there's about probably four or five little stone chips on the front that I can see in the video that probably need a little bit of attention. Not much, but just a brush touch. Bonnet looks really good. Just needs a good clean. So like I said, I'll try to find any imperfections and point them out for you in this video presentation as well. Really nice 18 inch alloy wheels. Front tires look brand new. So probably 100 or I'd say 95% there to be safe, but they also, they honestly look like they're about 100%. Paintwork nice and glossy as well. Let's go down the side of the RAV. Get a nice side shot, I'll stand back here. Now on my RAV4, I've actually got the top half painted gloss black, or my wife's RAV4. So from this line here, I've actually painted this, this, the roof, all that black, all the way down to here, all gloss black. I painted the mirrors gloss black and got the window tint really dark and it looks awesome. But that's obviously optional. Um, cost me about uh, nearly $2,000. So it wasn't a cheap exercise, but it does look unreal. That's just a bit of dirt there that I've seen. I thought that was a stone chip. Now there is a little mark just here on this back door I wanted to point out. That's a little stone chip that's been touched up just there on that back door. So you can see that. I did want to point that out for you. Like I said, I'd rather be 100% transparent and honest in the video presentation so you know exactly what type of car you're getting.
rear tire probably 95 or 100 percent as well guys tiny little scuff mark just here i reckon that will probably buff out that definitely hasn't gone through the paint so i'll try to get that out for you i reckon i reckon i'm gonna get that out with my finger so that's probably just from being on the yard people walking around it Another little scuff mark just here that doesn't feel like it's through the paint i reckon that should probably come out as well guys like i said i'd rather point this stuff out to you you know it is a pre-owned vehicle but like i said it's i'd rather point everything out or as much as i can find while i'm walking around it so there's no hidden surprises the boots always have a bit of scuffing and that kind of thing in here that's pretty standard pretty standard looking boot in here there's a little couple of gashes on this side that's pretty normal spare wheel so you can see there a little bit folded up there just from catching when sliding something into the boot that's all pretty normal when looking into the boot of a car like doing these video tours for you so you can get a really you know the photos you know always hard to get a really good gauge on what a car's like in photos where these videos they really you know they do the car justice you know they give you guys a nice transparent way of looking at a car which is what we love little stone chip just here which i can get touched up and another little stone chip just here which can get touched up that's just a bit of dirt up there so yeah just that little one and this little one here like i said they're pretty pretty tiny but better to show you than not show you so when the car gets down to claremont or gets to Mackay, we're all happy so i did tell you on the phone i did see a couple little marks on the driver's door just this one just here it's a funny looking scratch i don't know what would have done it but it is there just there on the door the rest around it looks like dirt but just that one there i wanted to point out it's barely through the paint like it's really minor but i don't know if it'll come out with a buff or a polish to be honest with you but you can see it there and there is a tiny little stone chip just here near the door handle, which I would get brush touched for you. All right. Couple little marks on the seat. They do need another clean. Like I said, they do get fully cleaned again. They get a little bit grubby on the yard, so I do apologize. Little mark just here where something's caught on the back of the seat. It's kind of frayed it a little bit. jump in now the car is running can't obviously hear it because it's hybrid they are awesome so you can see there 33,000 k's automatic headlights automatic wipers multi-function steering wheel so cruise control lane departure warning adaptive cruise control which is awesome bluetooth voice connectivity radio controls it's all there Steering wheel's in excellent condition. Got your big screen in the dash. I'll put the car in reverse now to show you that. Awesome. Aircon's nice and cold as you'd expect. Dual zone aircon. So both front passengers can have different temperatures. This here is a phone charger. Put your phone in there, in that little 
area, that little compartment, and it will charge your iPhone for you. Do also have USB connectivity down here as well and 12 volt power outlet. Automatic handbrake. Cup holders, center console. The little mark on the center console just over here. Don't know what it is, but I did want to point that out for you. Just on that side, you barely see it, but it's just just on that edge being pretty picky. But like I said, I'd rather be picky for you. You have your genuine floor mats in here as well, which is a bonus. Like I said, it just really needs a good a good clean. Needs a really good clean. You do have two fully functioning keys. So you can see them there. All right, now, I did wanna go through this with you. As I did say on the phone, it's got great service history. So let's try do this with one hand. Sorry, bear with me. It's making me look silly now. All right, here we go. 16,000. 32 or 33,000. So all the service history is there. All the log books are there. Two keys. So all really, really good. I'll give it a bit of a rev. The engine just turned on then. All right, let's get out now. Well, I hope you did enjoy watching this video presentation, John and Leilani, and um, Watch this. Let me know your thoughts, as I'd uh, I'd love to uh, love to help. Thanks again.